Well, hi everybody, welcome back. Uh, we are finally on the road. We have been on the road for two weeks now and we're here, we're boondocking. We're in the Medicine Bow National Forest in Wyoming. We found this great site, so I wanted to show you around. It's so cool. Views in every direction. Trees, rock, and ask for more. It is gorgeous. How are you feeling? I'm feeling good. I'm feeling very good. The weather was nice. It was a little breezy earlier, but uh, got used to it. We're good to go. Check this out. Here's our spot. I apologize about the wind noise, but we are in Wyoming. <laughs> There's our rig. Nice little seal. Yeah, the wind keeps the bugs away. Let's go see what Stevie's up to. Oh, I think she wants to come outside too. You want to go outside? Come on. What are you doing, Missy? Hey, how are you doing? Good girl. So I kind of wanted to show you around also uh, now that we're living in this, we've been living here for two weeks now in our motor homes. This is what our living room looks like. We have a TV there. Here's our dog kennels. That's one, that's Stevie's kennel. She's kind of bigger, Cody's kennel. And here's our kitchen. And here's our bedroom. And right here is our bathroom. And then our shower is just right here across the hall and that's our shower it's a pretty big decent sized shower so i just wanted to come on and kind of show you guys around really quick and show you where we're living and what we're up to good morning we had a restful evening last night and just took it easy um the breeze was a lot i mean it was very very windy here so we kind of hung out a lot inside in the evening time uh last night and just chilled out and watched a movie but uh, this morning we're gonna go for a hike, but first Eric's gonna make us some breakfast. What you making this morning? This morning we are gonna have some breakfast tacos. We'll make some uh, tater tot, potato, some refried beans, egg, fried little cheese, hot sauce. Nice. Sounds good. Paprika, a little bit of chili powder, and a little bit of cumin. Oh, it's frozen. Oh my. Wow. It really is frozen. Sounds like a clean workstation. <laughs> We just want to see what's on the other side of that peak. Love the way aspens shimmer in the wind. That was a good little jaunt. Going all the way up there. Time for a tick check.
after our nice relaxing hike, we've just kind of been hanging out and um, I'm cooking dinner now, so I was gonna show that to you. I have pasta going here, just some rotini pasta and canned um, artichoke hearts, broccoli, a can of fire roasted stewed tomatoes and some salmon, some leftover salmon that we had. And our batteries are at 99%. He's happy that our batteries are at 99%. Yes. Pretty cool. Well, good morning. We came out here for a short drive up to this um, military bunker and it's in the middle of Medicine Bow National Forest where we are and we don't know much about it. We're gonna find out about it when we get back home. Yeah, there's this one's called Brisby um, and uh, it's a historic site and then there's another one down the road we're gonna check out that it looks like it's more intact where you can actually uh, get inside and see it. And then, unfortunately, there's a lot of graffiti, but you know, it happens. Yeah. Again, there's four large pipes. Yeah. Check out these pipes. How far do those go? <laughs> I'm sure people drop, stuff in there. drop stuff in there, yeah. With your serpent your diamond eyes, and blood dripping from your smile. Well, that's not something you see every day. <laughs> very interesting, isn't it? It is very echoey in here, and I'm just I'm still wondering what it was for. Yeah, we're gonna have to find out for sure. See, same they're thing. all they're all the same thing. They they drop down through there. So what would that be for? If any of you know what those holes in the ground might have been that lead to the down below the bunker, let us know in the comments section because I would like to know. <laughs> Well, good morning. We are going to have a nice breakfast and then we're going to hit a trail. I don't remember what it's called right now, but I'll let you know in a minute. We're going to go hiking. We're going to go for uh, about a three mile hike or so. Yeah. How are you doing? <laughs> Can't throw a swarm at something. We're at um, uh, the Happy Jack Trail. That's it. The Happy Jack Trail. Good job. It's a very nice trail. Well groomed. There's even bathrooms along the way. It's beautiful. We made it back from our hike and now we're just going to kind of chill out for the evening. Um, the weather's kind of turned a little bit really breezy and a little bit gloomy so we're just going to hang out inside tonight. Have a good night. <laughs> good afternoon everybody. Uh, we are filming inside today because it is got wind gusts of what 20 miles an hour? 40. 30? 40. 40. <laughs> 40. I think it's up to 40. Today. It's kind of a lot so yeah so we're um, we're filming inside because it would be really hard for you guys to hear us otherwise but um, just wanted to come on and kind of let you know that uh, this area where we're out out here is Medicine Bow National Forest outside of Laramie and this is specifically called the Pole Mountain area and as you can tell um, big rigs can get back here pretty easily um, the one thing is that I would definitely scout out a little if you were to go further further in the roads get windier and har harder to get to Absolutely. so definitely take a scout uh, vehicle down there if you can. 
other than that, oh, you can stay here for, I believe it's 16 days. If it's not 16, it's definitely 14. Definitely 14. I think we read somewhere it was 16. 16, yeah. So you might be able to stay here 16 days. Um, you have to pack everything in, pack everything out. There's no facilities whatsoever, but there's... We are like 15 to 20 minutes or so from Laramie, and uh, it's a quick little jaunt over there. We actually got through uh, doing laundry, went to Spick and Span Laundry, I think, and yep. a really cool kind of 70s looking laundromat. Uh, of course, about five to six uh, minutes or miles away, uh, there's the Lincoln Memorial uh, at a rest stop, and you can go uh, drop off trash, you can um, get water. And we've gotten yeah. water a couple of times there, uh, potable water, so that's been cool. Yeah, and I think the closest dump station might be either in Laramie or in Cheyenne. Definitely but... in Laramie at the uh, historic prison uh, site. There you go. Yep. Yeah. I think you have to pay five or ten bucks, but yeah. uh, at least there's dump yeah, station. Yeah, it's worth it. So anyways, thank you guys for joining us for this video and for coming back. And give us a thumbs up if you liked anything and subscribe if you'd like to follow along. Um, we're a small channel and growing, so um, anyways, give us a follow if you'd like. Thank so you. thank you for coming back. See you later. Bye. Bye.